Hello, hello. You have reached Mystic Mohawk. And I come to you today with a charm reading. So we're going to do a Divine Feminine charm read. What are the energies of Divine Feminine? So the first charm that wants to look out at me is the evil eye. So we have someone out here that's currently giving divine feminine the evil eye, the eye of hate, the eye of I don't like you. And divine feminine is currently in an energy of a girl's rock energy go divine feminine so divine feminine is in a current energy she's also in the energy where she is protecting herself in COVID 19. you go divine feminine okay so what are the other energies of divine feminine divine feminine is currently in the energy where she just sitting back Drinking her little, uh, this look like to me, this look like one of them little energy drinks. What is that called? Uh, yeah, well, anyway, Divine Feminine may be one that goes to, uh, Starbucks a lot and gets her fruity little drink. This look like a fruity little drink or this look like a smoothie. So she's out here chilling. Divine Feminine is currently in the energy where she is in that get that bag energy. So this is my little get that bag energy with the money inside the bag. So Divine Feminine is in a get that money energy. We may be dealing with a Divine Feminine that have kids. So Divine Feminine it is in a Wonder Woman, Wonder Woman. Wonder Woman, she probably be in a, a Shiro energy that I can do anything. I can take care of these kids in COVID-19. I can get this money in COVID-19. I can start this new business in COVID-19. So divine energy is in a Wonder Woman energy. What are the other energies in? She's in at the current moment. Our divine feminine. Divine feminine is in an investigative energy energy divine feminine may be in an investigative energy this one here she may be in an energy where she start in school she may be in an investigative energy where she's trying to figure out like what is her career going to be like what kind of jobs is available to her so we have the little magnifying glass that represents investigation that means the start of things that means of finding out about oneself And this is our coat energy, our fur energy. So Divine Feminine may be in an energy where she's in a materialistic uh, retail uh, therapy energy where she's going shopping and she's buying her new things. And the next card that wants to stand out is the shopping card. So we have the shopping charm that wants to come out. So Divine Feminine may be over there doing her retail therapy, going to get her nice little clothes for the spring. The look nice because we know easter is coming so she knows she's in the energy where she's shopping she's getting her new things she's getting prepared for the spring summer coming so she's getting her clothes together she's in a retail therapy mode she's also in a mode where she's looking back on things she's looking at her camera she's now realized the things that she did in her last relationship that she could have made better she's looking at those red flags and saying damn i didn't know i was that way in a relationship my next relationship i'm looking back on it i will not do the same thing i will not accept the things that i accept with divine masculine i am not going to accept that in my new relationship what else is divine feminine saying she's saying this is the cassette this is the cassette and the cassette represents oh play out 
uh, way of thinking of not doing things anymore. She's not accepting what people telling her. She's not um in an energy where uh people can't tell her things and she's going to believe it. No, she's going to research it and find out the answer. And it's not to her approval. She's going to leave you alone. That is the energy that she's in. What other energies that she's in? She's in an energy where she want, just want peace and freaking quiet. And she just want to deal with herself. And she just want to get herself together. She do not want to be bothered with no drama. She do not want to be bothered with no August. She do not want to be bothered with anything that does not deserve divine feminine. Mm -mm. What other energies is divine feminine in at the current time? Divine feminine, we are currently in... Uh, we are currently in, uh, uh, the lack of the Irish and divine feminine is very, it's feeling very luckily right now. She's feeling like her ships is coming in. She's feeling like things is on her way. She don't know what those things is, but she's willing to take her journey and she's willing to take that step to know to the unknown. However, she's willing to do that and she's willing to make things better for herself. What other energies that she's in right now? Divine Feminine is currently in the energy of get, gotta get that paper dog, gotta have that paper dog. So she's in the energy where she's getting that money. She's spending her money. She's looking at that, calculating it, calculating her finances. She putting money up. She's saving for a rainy day. We also have these divine feminists out here that's putting money up to start that new business, to start that podcast, to start those things that's going to bring in that residual wealth. What else is Divine Feminine doing? Yes, Divine Feminine is currently in the energy where she's getting those APR rates down. She's getting that, uh, her credit score together so she can get those credit cards in order so she can just say, I just want to charge it for my retail therapy. And what comes out again? Another damn money call. Ooh, not another damn money call because we don't say money. We don't say damn when it comes to money. But another charm that came out is the money charm and when this charm come out that means that abundance is on the way that means that the things that you that you did divine feminine you will be rewarded with them abundantly okay and this one we might have a divine feminine that's out here that's out here trying to get her bs in in the medical profession so we have one of those out here that may be trying to be a nurse okay What else? Okay, and I see the passport. We have Divine Feminine, one that may be out here making plans to travel, making plans to do things this summer. I know that's right, Divine Feminine. You going down to the State Department, getting that, that, uh, that, uh, that passport to go out the country. I know that's right, girls, taking them trips and all them things. Okay, what else is Divine Feminine doing? Mmm. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, we come with the 3D. So we have Divine Feminine out here that's currently maybe being attacked in the 5D or the 3D because this charm came up and this charm represents somebody might be up late at night because somebody might be doing damn magic and somebody's ancestors is saying hell to the Oh, no, to the no, 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 you ain't going to do it to my divine feminine. Divine feminine, wake up, wake up. And I'm looking at this charm that comes after it is the black. This is the black angel call. So when the black angel comes, this call comes at night when somebody is trying to do black magic on you. Uh, So divine feminine, word to the wise. When your ancestors waking you up, please get up. Please get up. That is your shield. That is your protection of your ancestors trying to tell you that something ain't right. And somebody is trying to do cognitive dissonance against you when you are at your weakest state. And that is asleep. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what are the other messages that you would like to give to Divine Family?
So we have the computer here. We have the computer here because we have divine feminine. We have the computer here. We may have one that may have started an IT profession. We may have one that may have started a YouTube channel. We may have one that may be working on her uh her website so that she can start her own business. But however, whatever those prospects is on the computer, divine feminine, please keep your uh spam 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 web together. Please keep it because we know people are hawking stalking and trying to be in your business so please keep your personal business personal and change your email and change that password because we have somebody down here that wants to be in your business and again we have the airplane which represents divine feminine is leaving all of this crap this could this could be leaving a past relationship leaving a job leaving anything that does not deserve the fam she is leaving it all behind what else is the fam doing the fam is calculating her phones so we have the, a femme here that may be in a, a, a energy where she's calculating her phone, she's getting her money together, she's calculating her um her uh credit score to try to get better things. However, when this calculation appears, this appears that one is trying to get stable financially. What else is the femme doing? We have the damn gesture and the damn skeletons that came out. So the fam is currently feeling like she may have been in something where she may feel foolish. She may feel like the relationship that she that she made with someone made her feel foolish because she's finding out the real deal, holy feel about somebody's person. And she's finding out that this person had a lot of skeletons in their closet. Don't feel foolish, Divine Feminine. That was just their actions and what they did. Don't feel foolish. What else is what else is this? This may be a Gemini that we talking about. An intelligent Gemini. This person may be a Gemini. This person may be an intelligent Gemini that's intuitive, that's creative, that's communicative. That may be that kind of Gemini. What other kind of Gemini do we have? I mean, what other kind of person that we have out of here? Whoever this person is, this divine feminine that we talking about, this is a strong divine feminine. This is one that can go through a lot of things, and you would never know what's going on with her because she keep a pretty smile on her face. This is the person, divine feminine, that we talk about. And what other characteristics are we talking about? With this divine feminine. Oh, excuse me. Again, this damn 3D card, this 3D charm come up. Divine feminine, this comes up again. So your ancestors is telling you again, please protect yourself in the 3D. Someone is doing something that they don't have no business doing to you mentally in the 5D. Do not be mad because you are continuously being awoken. That is your protection. What else do your ancestors want you to know, Divine Feminine? ancestors are currently saying continue on your journey they are saying you go girl 
You go, girl. Whatever you are doing, Divine Feminine, your ancestors are proud. They saying continue on your journey. Continue to focus on Divine Feminine and your path that you currently are on. They are with it 110%. However, they are telling you, girl, they want you to meditate a little bit more. They want you to get a little bit into meditation. They want you to look it up. They want you to free your mind. And they want you to become closer with the vine and on the, on, along the lines of meditation. They want you to release a lot of things. And they saying that your friends right now, they have been those that was around for you. They said through this time... Your friends have been around and they have been the ones that help you. So continue to have gratitude and be very grateful for the friends that you have around you. And they are saying Divine Feminine, continue to get that bag. So the little baby, the little lady, the little bag come up to tell you continue to get that bag. What else is your ancestors telling you? What else? Your ancestors is telling you to relax more, girl. Stop being so uptight. So, we have the wine opener little thing, and we have the wine bottle. Your ancestors is trying to tell you to relax, have some fun, get some wine. Do you? Stop being, stop worrying about things that you cannot control. It's time for you to relax. It's time for you to do you. And your ancestors are telling you, please stop thinking about these negative things that is going on with your life. And your ancestors is telling you to get a dream catcher. Little dream catcher right here. This right here. Your ancestors is telling you to get a dream catcher. Something is going on with you where peep entities is trying to get into your mental while you are sleeping. Your ancestors is giving a download to get a dream catcher. Oops. Get a dream catcher. And your ancestors is saying. They are saying. Where is it at? They are saying, cut off that negative stuff. Anything that you feel negative, your ancestors is telling you to cut it out. Get it out your head. You are protective. Please stop thinking this is the Hamas hand, which means that you are protective. I don't know where the little eye had to go inside of it. It must have came out. But you are protected. And this protection comes from the divine and your uh, ancestors. Okay? And the next one that comes out here is the crucifixion cross. Which, again, says you are protected. What else your ancestors are telling you? What else do they want her to know? And this might be a Virgo. No, this is Scorpio. Sorry. And this might be for a Scorpio. Scorpio woman. Your ancestors is telling you. Stop thinking about this. This voodoo. This magic. Please get that out your mind. They are telling you. You are protected from the magic, from the voodoo, you are protected. Please stop thinking about it. And they are saying, love yourself. Put your shield, the armor up, and love yourself. These things cannot attack you. You are protected. And they are saying, you have what? Okay. And... They saying for somebody that may have their own Twitter page, they own TikTok, they own um, 
social media page, this is the at sign. This represents social media. They are saying whoever is trying to attack you, continue to try to let them attack you because you will be successful in your online business. What else is they saying, Holy Spirit? They saying you will crush them. You will stomp all over them and continue to be beautiful. This is the call for the little makeup case. So you continue to put on your makeup. You continue to stunt. You continue to be beautiful. You continue to put on your clothes and you continue to shine. Those that always have something to say about how you carry in your life, they really and truly adore you. Oh, when we dealing with a little sassy mouth. Divine Feminine, you like to tell people off. This one over here, this Divine Feminine, this represents the sassy mouth. This one don't say too much too often. But when she say what she say, and that's what she said, purred. Okay? The Divine Feminine with the sassy mouth. What other, let me, let me, yeah, what kind of Divine Feminine is this? That's what I want to know. What kind of divine feminine are we dealing with? Mm-mm, divine feminine got a sassy mouth. We dealing with a divine feminine that's a butterfly here. And we dealing with a, a, a divine feminine that was a caterpillar, a caterpillar that has turned into a butterfly. And we got the rocket. This one is on her way up. She is shooting for the stars and she is on her way up. This divine feminine that we talking about. And this divine feminine, this one... They can't even add it up to her. She don't even know it. She don't even know it. She just now getting into herself. She don't even know it. That they can't even add up to what she doing right now. So we got the two plus two is four. They can't add up. And they got the ruler. They still can't add up to this divine feminine. Because we got the card that come out of the cause that Divine Feminine is acing that she winning. She got the ace, the king, the queen, and the jack, and the ten. What? And she ain't playing no games. She ain't taking no prisoners. She don't want to be bothered. If you come in with the bull crop, and you coming over here to this Divine Feminine playing games, she telling you to march, nigga, step. I know that's what I do. What else is you saying, Divine Feminine? Divine Feminine is saying, go ahead with your magic, girl. You continue to do your magic, girl, because you is, every time that you do your magic, I continue to win. So you go ahead and do your magic, and she's going to continue to shop, and she's going to continue to get her bag again. I know that's right. Because all that bullshit that you talking about, get your shovel. It's dead to Divine Feminine. She put that shit away. She's still doing her shopping. She's still doing her retail therapy. And she wants you to know that uh, you continue with your magic. Because every time you do your magic, she goes shopping and she continues to win. That shit that you thought that you was doing to her is now dead and dealt with the shovel. And she is now saying her freaking chariot has came in. Where is that damn chariot? You just flipped on my hand, Chariot. You play too much. Where you at, Chariot? Child, I got glasses on and I still can't see. Where's the Chariot? You playing too much, Chariot. I picked it up and dropped it. Where's the Chariot? Chariot, stop playing. I know you. I picked it up. That daggone Chariot. Here we go. Because Divine Feminine is rolling out on her little chariot. Her thing, her ships is coming in. Her things is coming in. She is now grounded. She is now uh, knowledgeable of the divine. She is now knowledgeable how to win. She is now knowledgeable how to bring in her three streams of income and bring in her money. I know that's right, Divine Feminine. And as I say that, my dad on hand starts itching. And she knows that someone in the back line was giving shows. We have one, an uh, actress that like to give shows and play games with people. And she say, what? That old way of play, of thinking is play out. She's going to continue to do her retail shopping and she's going to be cute. She's going to continue to, and oh my God, Divine Feminine, 
I picked up there by mistake. But this right here, this color right here, this color right here represents our divine. This color right here represents our divine, the color of his feet. When they said his feet was made of copper and his skin was made of copper and his feet and his hair was made of wool and, and his eyes was of fire. That's what they say in the Bible that describes our divine. So, honey, we have right here the 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 color of copper which represents our divine feet which means that our divine is protecting you and leading you along the way with this copper color here i know that's right divine feminine we have our heavenly divine Lee and you, girl, we don't need no more when we got Lee and him. And then we have the umbrella right here, baby, that comes out and says, you are protected. And then right beside it, we have our lipstick card that says that you are beautiful. You continue to be sexy. You continue to be seductive. You continue to be natural because what you are beautiful, that is the lipstick card. I know that's right. And time is on your side. Yes, it is. You are getting ready to win, darling. You may feel like all of these things that is not going your way. So, our divine saying, get it out your head. 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 You are winning. I will pick that up later. Yes. Get it out your head. You are winning, baby girl. So you continue to be uh beautiful and you continue your retail shopping and you continue to look pretty and you continue to uh uh, those haters continue to look at you and see your life through a telescope because they want to be you, darling. That's what our divine is continue to say. You keep looking pretty and buying those pretty old bags and you keep on being out loud and you keep laughing out loud at your haters, you Sagittarius, because I'm, you Scorpio, because I'm getting the Scorpio to pick this one up. So you keep on laughing out loud at your haters when they watch you do your retail therapy and you're looking cute and you're smelling good and you're looking good and you're being a woman baby our divine song it's time for you to get out and stop being in that house and seek some nice fresh air and get your party on get your party on girl get your party on it's time for you to get outside and stop acting like that and here's another card that came out that says Okay, yes, you continue to purchase your retail therapy. And you continue to be pretty and you continue to uh do those things and you roll out on your little scooter because happiness is with you and you are beautiful. And you continue to go get those nails done, baby. And you get those hair done and you look nice, honey, because you are what? A divine feminine. And that is going to be the end of my charm reading today because my stomach is over here doing, Arr! yeah, all that. So I need to go get me some grubber dud and things. And I need to go take my doggies out for a walk before they do their things in my house. And we don't allow those things to go on over here. So, I am going to say I enjoyed this charm reading. And I do apologize for not doing a charm reading for the while. And Miss Sunshine, whatever your name is, yes, girl, you did say don't start it. You started with the charm reading, but you ain't finish it. But we are going to finish it now. So, I'm going to start doing the charm reading at least two times out of the week and again if you like my vibe like share and subscribe thank you